Welcome back to my Let's Play Golf Story series. This is the third episode. Um, if you remember last time, we went off and big coaches, students up on the um, the driving range. So we've got a, a little bit of a quest going on with those guys. Um, oh, it's going to help if you click the right thing. Uh, it's in my notes piece, isn't it? So I can go to his coach in the clubhouse, and then I've got these two guys. Um, but I think the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go and challenge this... Um, big hitter on the practice green and see where we get to so let's have a chat oh we get to do something fun Okay, so we're going to play for that green. Okay. Bouncing on the path on the way. Okay. So it's kind of an approach mode. Is it approach mode? Yeah. So I'm going to kind of back it off to there. Okay, right. Let's give this a go. How do you like them apples? Success. Yeah, and I level up. <laughs> Anger management issues. Okay. Yeah, so he was one of those up there. So if I go to store, if I go to notes. Yeah, okay. So I've got to beat this guy who's in the clubhouse. Right, I get it, I get it. Okay, so clubhouse. Where's Pie Boy? What's Pie Boy want? Uh, I'm hoping for some pasty action later. Uh, computer, is that the simulator? Wow. No. Ooh. I appear to be stuck. <laughs> Bugette. Well, that's good. Let me uh, let me go out and come in again. Let's do something quick and come in. That's a little feature, isn't it? There we go, right. Let's not do that again. Anything in the drawers? That's the RPG player inside me. Oh, there's your boy coach. I've still got to beat laughing boy, haven't I? Are there pies? No, we've done the pie thing. So where's the simulator then? Oh, is it over in the, where the projector is? Ah, here, here's your boy, here's your boy. Undefeated on a simulator, eh? <laughs> I literally don't know what you mean. Okay, gotta level up. So let's take some power, correct our accuracy. Oh, take a bit more power. Yeah, okay, I'll do that. <laughs> uh, 
I wonder if you can hit him. Be the club. I suppose you couldn't hit the geese, could you, in episode one, so. <laughs> They're basically all just little brats, aren't they? And this is, this is, um, oh, in the kisser. Yeah, he's getting paid, isn't he? Can you hit him in the chops, I wonder? Yeah, I did. I did win this challenge. God, he's so eager, isn't he? He's just so ridiculously eager. Can we talk to him again? Okay, right. So, we're off to see Coach then. Uh, who's in here? Let's do a little bit of RPGing on the way. Right, Coach, come on. Excuse me. Yeah, I beat all of your rubbish students. <sighs> Is he literally just talking cliches? You have to prove yourself, boy. Oh no, we're gonna go. We're gonna go feral. Okay. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna go play around. So pro shops over to the right, as I remember. Okay, they've been collecting balls. So, pro shop. Da -da 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 -da. You're asking me, pal. Ah, okay, so we could buy some stuff. So, we could buy some of that. What can we buy here? Basic discs. Not frisbees. So, okay, so you can play disc golf, I suppose. Let's see how much a round is. <laughs> well, let's buy. Let's buy some irons. Boom. Do I want a frisbee? Ah, buy it. I got the dish. I got the dosh. I'd like to play around. Okay, so nine holes. Ah, so a little bit. Impact good, power a bit low, but that's okay. It's not a bad position. Tappy tap tap. Okay, so slopes a little bit to the right. I probably just want to back off it a smidgen and a little bit of backspin. It's probably back off it a touch too much. Yeah, just a little bit short and the line wasn't quite that. I suppose yeah, the slope it did sort of pitch. So this so it's uphill basically, isn't it? If the slope is towards me. Uh, let's have a look on. Oh, so what's the power? So that's about the power. Okay, so a slight slope is, is more slope than you'd think. Okay, lesson learned. Lesson learned. So you do have to hit them a bit harder for slight slope. Okay. Ah, we played this hole with the, with the boy, didn't we? Because this was the one. So again, I do want to shape it a touch. Oh, 
Oh, that's got a chance to green, hasn't it? Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Yeah, okay, I'll take that. Fairway. Ah, oh, looks a lot like the green to me. But hey, you know, okay. So, let's try and just pitch it there. Yeah, in the hood. Slam dunk eagle. What makes it a sl Oh, it's just because it hit the flag and dropped. So mega eagles, obviously, when you hit it from way off. Oh, wow, that's a long hole. Okay. So clearly that's not the place to go. Okay, so we need to get over here. Maybe let's land it, maybe about there. Keep it on the green stuff! Ay, ay, ay. Okay, so that was not great. Okay, but I've got a penalty shot, haven't I? Or a penalty stroke. Okay. So let's go pitching wedge. Let's back the pitching wedge off. It's going to slope a little bit to the left. And the line's not going to be wrong, so it's going to be impact spot on. Oh, no, 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 Mr. Badger, no, 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 no. Ah. Oh. Yeah, that's some punishment. Okay, so you've basically got to get the line right. You've just got to get the line right. <sighs> that was hard work for a par. That was hard work for a par. So those hazard zones are bad. Yeah, okay. So again, what are my options here? I've just got to back this off, haven't I? And try and kind of pitch it in. Oh, I mean, that's pretty much exactly where you'd if you dropped it, you'd drop it there. Okay. Okay, so I probably just want to pitch it on a touch, don't I? Right. That might be interesting. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow, there's just no margin for error. Okay. So. That's got to be good. That's got to be good. Okay. I'll take my par. So this is all about positioning, isn't it? It's all about making your shot into the right area. Okay, look again, so narrow that is there. You've got to get it into that little corridor. I suppose actually the trick is to back it off, isn't it? So you're not kind of playing into those areas like that! I've got to learn what the carry versus the roll is on this a little bit better as well, I think. Because that's going to be my problem, isn't it? Is, is you land in the right spot, but then it just, yeah. So I should have known that was just going to keep going. So that's the thing I kind of need to learn. Oh, 
But again, chipping's a reasonably easy. Chipping birdie. I suppose there's not much wind about at the moment. I think when you get courses with with more wind, I'm assuming chipping's become become tougher. Wow. So there's not really much room to work there at all, is there? I kind of hit it through. That's got to be the play here, isn't it? Is to go through. You do get a fair bit of roll. Yeah, okay. So it's rough, but at least it didn't end up in the bunker. So let's back this one off. Again, I'm going with the, against the slope and against the thing. That's just going to be slightly offline, isn't it? Just enough. That's another chip in Eagle. Course management, I suppose, is the is the skill that you need. Okay. Uh, I think your impact is going to be more important than your power, actually, isn't it? I think your positioning, although you know, having a bit more length never hurts. So let's try and sort of pitch and run. That's, that's just not good. So yeah, it's just not right. Not a right. Deep rough. But what impact does that have on your on your range? Let's see. Okay, so it doesn't knock too much off your power. Slam dunk birdie. Oh, see, I'm picking up those new medals, aren't I? This is a big dog look, so yeah, we need to come across here. Okay, what's up there? I think actually I want to back, I want to back off this one, don't I? Just run up to there. I think that's the play. Oh, that's ridiculously overhit. Yeah, that was that was just silly. Just silly. Okay, so I lose the stroke, but I don't lose the distance, which is, I suppose, a bit of a, a, bit of a compensation. And that's probably over here a little bit. Yeah, but it's okay. It's okay. That gives me a putt, putt for a par. Okay, so that's the power. And the slopes that way, so I want to borrow a little bit. But again, I don't. I haven't got a feel for these greens yet. Let's try that. So let's try. What does a cup look like? Okay, so it is like a whole cup. Okay, so six under. You don't really get the grid you get in everybody's golf, so you just got that arrow. So that's reading the greens could be could be interesting. Okay. So this one should be just get hold of it. That'll do the job. You get a nice little multicolored trail, I think, when you when you really connect. So 258. Okay, so what's around here? You can kind of pitch it in the rough and see how that goes. That should take a lot off it. Yeah, I suppose if that pitched in the rough, that would have been about right. But, you know, we didn't. We managed to miss that. So let's go for my dunk. Oh, that's a bit, it's a bit under. I was only a chip in, it wasn't a slam dunk. So there is some distinction between the two. But hey, it's not a bad round. Got ten bucks, nearly got a... Two thirds of a level's worth of XP. 
I've got a scorecard. I suppose we go back to coach, don't we? See what um, see what the coach has to say about it. I said it's a quick look. Is it up here in our items? Ah, it does bring to coach. Okay. Yeah, okay, so the quest ends up on there. Okay, I think I'm going to call it quits. We'll, we'll see what Coach has to say in the next episode. I hope you're enjoying this Let's Play. If you are, leave me a comment. Um, I'm kind of enjoying it. It's a different game to everybody's golf, but you know, it's a little bit more RPG, which actually I quite enjoy. The art style's good. The mechanics seem quite interesting. Um, yeah, so I'll see you next time.